a treat, or both. Hi, everybody. James Savalski here for EA Sports. It's Halloween night here on the ice tonight. Oh, this building's electric, and both teams are set to go. The Jets are going to start with the puck after taking the opening draw. And he slides it quickly to Shifley. No room for that one to get through. Sends the pass over. And he dodges the puck check there. Oh, -ho! great glove save. Where'd that come from? Takes a hit, but still hangs on to the puck. Oh, great play to sidestep the poke check. Oh, gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. The shot's coming from the middle of the ice, and he hit has some heat on it, but he's ready and waiting for it. He's to position, and he makes the save. Hellebuck's going to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Lots of time left in this period. We're still scoreless. The Jets win the draw on their own end. Tampa Bay's got a hold of it along the wall. The Lightning have it on the attack. Puck grabbed by Gensel. From the blue line, they take control of it. And now it's grabbed by Connor. Puck picked up by Morrissey. Good read with the stick to break that up. From center, they get into the attacking area. Moves the puck along the half wall. Can't complete the pass as it goes off a stick. The Bolts move it in. Here's a shot! Tremendous stop by Hellebuck. Takes the feed. Quickly over to Chernak. Winnipeg's got possession of the puck. And it's a quick pass to Ehlers. Up to the challenge as he gets his pad on it. Gains control of the puck the line. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. He's got a step! Oh, to the right to single the ball! and his breakaway speed to close away from the pack. And then he knows exactly what he's going to do, or at least he fools us and the goaltender because he puts it in the back of the net. The Lightning have been pushing, and they finally break through with the game's first goal. Yeah, they capitalize finally, James, and that's the execution they needed. But there's not much ice out there, not much separating these two teams. So this next shift to create and continue that momentum is really important. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. He tries to tuck it in, and a great save. As a goaltender, you want to make yourself as big as possible, and that's a <laughs> right now leading by two Lowry's gained possession inside the neutral zone can't maintain possession they've got numbers to his teammate and he gets a glove on it to keep it up hey take it along the wall by Niederreiter dishes it to Lowry quick pass to Appleton oh great move to sidestep the check here he is on the back end Big time save by Vasilevsky. The goaltenders are the last line of defense for a reason. This time, he bails his team out. Here's a chance. Club save, and the play continues. And that pass is redirected. The Jets scoop it up along the boards. The Lightning have taken to the offensive attack. Here's a short pass to Paul. And a good save on the play as action continues. And a strong effort on that play. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit. Here's a shot. They score!
Tampa Bay's taken full advantage of their scoring opportunities with a comfortable lead here in the first. Winnipeg's won the draw. Quick feed to Malarty. The Bolts have it now. Scoops up the puck here. Here they come on the rush. That's blocked by Hellebuck. In front of the net, and the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Tampa Bay is going to want to take this lead into the first intermission. They have really looked sharp tonight. The Jets win the draw. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Passes it over to Velarde. Oh, what a move to get by there. Puck dumped in. The Lightning have taken possession along the wall. Moves it to Gensel. Taken by Hedman. Oh, look at this. Here they come. They've got numbers. He's him up. Makes the save. And that ricochets off a twig in front. Moves it quickly over to Shifley. Here we go. Pucks in deep. The Jets gain control of the puck. Now a quick pass to Connor. In all. This is a great save, James. The goaltender gets it. The... And they beat the buzzer and get one late here in the period. They always say, James, that the start of period and the finish period, they're critical times, and they get one here. They go to the dressing room with a lot of momentum. They can't blame the goalie on this one who's tracking the puck, and then all of a sudden it changes direction because it deflects off of a defender in front. Real tough puck luck. The Bolts lead it here late in this first period. Winnipeg's won the draw in the neutral zone. Receives the pass. Spectacular stop by the goal. Oh, at the buzzer, a big save. There you go. Number one is done. We're going to come back in just a quick moment with period number two. Stay with us. Be sure to attend our Autumn Light Truck Show next weekend. And the opening face-off here in period number two is about set. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, we've seen a pretty good sample size already played thus far. Cheryl, your assessment. Tampa Bay's had an impressive start to this game. Now they're heading into the second. It's a bit of an ice tilt in the first, so they want to continue that and opening up lanes. The biggest thing about that is when you open up lanes, you've got to attack and drive. You've got to know exactly when to shoot the puck, and they've been doing it so far in this game. Stoppage and play offside the call. left to be played in this period. Tampa Bay's got a 3-1 lead as they have dominated for the most part in this. Shifley's won the draw inside the neutral zone. They'll go to work offensively here. Picked up along the boards by Morrissey. Sends it into the offensive zone. He looks deep to Gensel. Tampa Bay's through center and now in the offensive end. Long jam in front. That's broken up. A chance in front, and he denies that great opportunity there. Redirected off one of his own linemates there. And now he moves it quickly to Shifley. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Feeds the puck, a chance on the rush here. Shoots, all spectacular save to shut down the rush. Goaltender, they have to have talent, they have to have mobility, they have to be able to track the puck, but they have to have a willingness to find it and fight for any second shot, and that's exactly what happens here. Out battling, out willing, and you make the save. Tampa Bay's message was clear coming into this one. Lots of shots on net, and they lead here in this second. Winnipeg's got possession here in their own end. Takes the feed. And he slides it quickly to Nemestikov. 
Here we go, odd man rush here. Slider laying with the blocker by Vasilevsky. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. It's a 3-1 hockey game. Lots of offense already. Winnipeg's got the puck inside the offensive zone. Big time stop there. Vasilevsky's been solid here tonight, James. I mean, look at his save percentage. He's been excellent between the crease, and that's making the saves that you need to and you want to at the appropriate moment. Man, his team's been effective going north. The Jets gain control. A couple of knocks and loses control. Quick pass to Ehlers. Oh, look at this chance. Shot! And that's off the glove and will play on. And he slides it quickly to Stanley. Puck scooped up by Isimov. From the neutral zone now. Huge play. Oh, what a chance here. Smart defensive effort to break up that play. Slides the puck to SMO. Fires it! And he'll likely feel that one in the morning. Here's a short pass to Appleton. Strong defensive effort. Scooped up along the wall by Perbex. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And there's the save. The Jets move the puck in the defensive zone. Shakes off the defender with some nifty moves. Break away! Oh man, you're all in on this one. Like, look at him, flat out on his belly to make the save. High risk, but huge reward. The Bolts have been the better team, leading in the shot department, and they lead it on the scoreboard. The Jets win the faceoff. Good, solid check, and he loses control of it. Pass to Gensel. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. Grabbed along the board by Kucherov. And he turned that aside as we continue play here. Muffs the shot attempt. Hellebuck's one of those goaltenders that the busier he gets, the more efficient he becomes, and it's save after save as his confidence grows and he's more dialed into the game. And they strike pay dirt once again. Yeah, they do. And their opponents down on their heels are deflated. They gotta find a way to continue with the pressure, be relentless, and try and get another one. Just a fabulous goal, Jane, with a lot of elements woven into it. I mean, he's stumbling, so he almost falls, but he's able to get a shot off just in time. He's able to hold himself up and get that shot off. His hands away from his body, not in the greatest position, but he manages to find the back of the net. Winnipeg's goal late here in period number two has given them new life here late. They'll need to take that life and re-energize themselves, but it's been all about good habits, not getting frustrated at the score, finding a way to put it in. They just did it. Perfetti's going to play it against the half wall. Oh, what a score! Tie game! Well, you can't worry about what happened in the game, James. It's all about what you do now, staying in the present. That's exactly what they've done, and they've got the equalizer. Winnipeg's offensive pressure has resulted in an equalizer here tonight. As an athlete, you always know the end of the period is critical timing. You want to maintain pressure and you want to gain momentum heading into the third. That goal did just that. Handles the pass at center. The Bulls look to start the transition game. Gaining momentum along the wing. Oh, look at this. Puck grabbed by Glenn Denning. And now it's grabbed by Nemestikov. Ehlers takes it inside his own end. And he feeds it down to Perfetti. And it's a quick pass to Ehlers. And he loses control here. Along the right side into the offensive zone. An easy save by Hellebuck. Slides it on over to Nemestikov. Tosses it on to Atkinson. Well, there you go. Two periods down, one more to go, at least for now, right? Third period, just around the corner. Are you a super fan? Here's your chance to prove it. 
Teams are lined up, and they are ready to get this third period underway. And we are underway here in the third, still evened up. Will we see that go-ahead goal here? And kept that one out of the net. Chance in front, and he shuts the door again. Man, he was right on that puck. He knew exactly where it was. It was tight to the crease. He got out and challenged right away to make the save. Tampa Bay's got the puck now. Offside the call, we'll get a reset. Well, here's a little help from a friend. Uh, I love that he jumps in here. Doesn't even give his star player an opportunity to get into this fight. You can't have him fighting and getting injured. And there's the winning blow. Did he ever connect on that one, James? And now look at him on the ice. He's laboring to get up. You try to get your team going. Sometimes the fight is what happens, and this is exactly it. But the winner is going to the home team. A nice little break for the defenseman here. One less forward to deal with as we have some four-on-four -four hockey on tap. On a four-on-four, -four, you can expect all players on the ice when you're possessing the puck to activate. You have to be able to support the puck carrier. And if you're a defender, you know you're jumping into a lane going north. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Hellebuck's got the puck, and he's going to slow things down. Well, he's slowing things down because his team has been under siege, James. It's the third period. It's a tight game, and he elects to get the whistle. I like this decision. It's the right one. No one can get a rest, and coach can get the right personnel out there. Now a quick pass to Morrissey. Oh, look at this. The Ports have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Hellebuck. Picked up along the wall by Morrissey. Fires it, denies him! This is a fantastic save, James. He's all over it. What I mean by that is he knows exactly where it is and where it's moving. A reason why he can get square to it and make the save. Tampa Bay's got possession at center. There's a hit on the play. And loses possession after a solid hit. Takes a shot. Spectacular save on the play. Connors got it along the wing. Sends it to the middle. Oh, what a chance, and that goes off target. The Bolts cross the blue line and are on the attack. Big time glove saved by Hillebuck. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Nearing the midway mark of the period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. The Jets win the defensive zone faceoff. Beautiful feed up ahead from the right wing side. Fires it on net. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. The setters will glide in. Hot. The Jets come up with the defensive zone draw. Slides it diagonally to Perfetti. Knocked away by Radish. The Lightning have the puck in their own end. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Makes the save again. That's a fantastic sequence of saves there. James, he was so dialed in, he tracked it perfectly. Now over to Ehlers. Avoids the Well, you do, especially when you get those great A scoring chances. You have to find a way to, at minimum, get it to the net. But, man, I think he had a little more time on his side, and it just ricochets off his toe. More than half the period has expired. we got a tie game. The Jets win the draw. Elis works the puck in his own zone. Poked away in the defensive end. Great reflex on display tonight on his part. Made the stop on the play. Moves the puck down low. And now he moves it quickly to Keon. And that carries off one of his teammates in front. Athletes are so competitive. He didn't just stay down. He got back up, James, and he's making his way towards the bench. But you can clearly see that he is not 100%.
Face off coming up. They can smell blood here, I think. Yeah, they need to put their foot on the gas pedal because they recognize that the goaltender, he was under siege, James, and he really didn't get a chance to get much rest. Puck sent down the ice. We'll get an icing. A big face off here inside the offensive end. The Jets take possession here inside the offensive zone. Center bears down on that bottom hand. A clean win, and you can see them all setting up, looking to attack the net against this tired group. The Lightning have the puck in the neutral zone. Shot! Play is whistled dead as the puck goes up and over. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Nemestikov's won it off the faceoff. Ehlers takes it along the wing. Here's an offensive chance. Stopped by the goaltender. Puck picked up by McDonough. Puts it on the end. Comes up with the stop. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Shot denies him with the save. Taken by Appleton. Winnipeg's looking to break out. And he sidesteps the check all alone. Turn the side. Oh, that was huge. Well, it's a timely save, James. There's no question about it. I mean, the shooter, he knows how important this opportunity is, and he's not able to execute. He wanted to be a difference maker. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Winnipeg's won the draw, they'll go to work. Hammers the shot, can't get it to go. Slides it up to Sorelli. Under a minute to play in this dandy. Perfetti's out for the remainder of the game, James, with that injury he suffered earlier. We just received word from the staff that he will be out for an indefinite amount of time. An unfortunate storyline here throughout the game, and now we know for sure he won't be back. Sends a pass over. Moves the puck. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Knocked around, but keeps it going. Picking up ahead of steam on the breakaway! Tonight. Well, it's been unbelievable in particular down the stretch and keeping the game close here with it on their stick. They have to find a way to execute. Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. Tries to get the puck to Morrissey. Quick feed to Connor. And look at that penalty coming up. When you're on a breakaway, you have to be able to get the shot off, and he gets taken down from behind. The tripping puck. Makes the stop under pressure. Big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Shifley's won the face off, and now let's see what they can do. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. And a strong physical collision on the play there. There's the horn bringing an end to regulation hockey, and it's been a tense one here tonight. And guess what? The intensity is going to ramp up to another level because sudden death overtime is coming up. Will we get a winner here in overtime as we are underway? Shakes off the coverage. Great reach with the poke check. Moves it to Kucherov. Off a stick, and they can't connect. They've got some momentum here for the win. There it is. They score and win it in overtime. I'll tell you what, this squad came to play tonight. counter attack and brilliant speed to get on his horse and get in on the
Breakaway, James, and that momentum, it carries right through on his shot, and he puts it home. Well, that'll do it for our special Halloween broadcast here tonight from all of us here at EA Sports. Happy Halloween, and kids, if your parents say they want to inspect your candy, make sure they don't steal it. Take care, everyone.